Yokozuna shows his disdain for American culture by mowing down the competition and celebrating his achievements on American holidays. Yokozuna is entitled to his opinion, and he can celebrate his accomplishments how he sees fit. Here's an idea. If his opponent doesn't like it, do something about it. Yokozuna demands everyone show him the proper respect, and those who don't will suffer dearly. Yeah, but he has his work cut out for him against the superstar who is always prepared for competition, always focused and ready to go out there and compete. That preparation is the type of thing that elevates a superstar, Saxton. Oh, the knee takes a big hit. And Yokozuna's maintaining the advantage now. Yeah, Yokozuna just can't be stopped now. This could be an opportunity. Yokozuna ascends to the top. Oh, boy. He's stalking him. Watching for an opening. Yokozuna, obviously a champion in his heyday, but what does it take for him to win in today's WWE? Oddly enough, Yoko is way ahead of the curve. He has the agility a lot of big men today have to work to attain. And he's got that old school adaptability to absorb and inflict punishment. His game is truly timeless. He just has to keep it simple and stick to it. Boot to the stomach. Gut kick. Nothing fancy there. And that was taking the attack to the competition with that one. Oh, right to the leg. It looks like there is no fear in the eyes of Yokozuna's opponent now. He had from the top. Fails to hit the bullseye. That one. Cover, cover. Getting the shoulder up before two. He's not letting fatigue set in or get the better of it. something. Boom! Hitting the ropes. Massive big leg drop! Is it enough? Two count and a kick out. He really thought that was it. And proving a bit slippery for him there. He's in a little bit of trouble now. Yeah, if there's one thing Yokozuna knows how to do, it's throw his weight around. Oh, man. And Yokozuna is really putting the pressure on. Timeless offense on display from the Hall of Famer Yokozuna, using a mix of power and agility to inflict serious punch. Continuing to attack the neck. Oh, draped over the top rope. Oh, oh man. This has no, no, this no, this no. Isn't planned. He's upset. Look who's marched into the ring. Turn around and go back to the locker room. There's no reason for him to be out here right now. From behind, two oh, boys. Shoulders down. 
I thought for sure that was it. These men have been all gas and no brakes tonight, and they have to be feeling the effects. Well, they have to be running on fumes. I don't know how much longer they can go. Going for a power slam, turning it into a power slam. Yokozuna now being sized up. Popped up. No way. Yes way. What power. Stone pile driver. Yokozuna's in serious danger. Two. What a kick out at two. A behemoth like Yokozuna kicking out of that. That doesn't make you wonder what it'll take to keep him down. That was plan A, and it didn't work. He must be thinking about plan B at this point. He saw it coming, taking advantage. Sharp punch. Gets tossed. He's got the target acquired. Just a matter of moments. Try that. Was trying to find a way to attack, but completely wiped out. He climbs into the ring. I don't know if I want to go on this trip, guys, but you might have to because it's the longer way down. Last ride. That's gotta be it. Two count digging deep for a kick out. He has him right where he wants him. <laughs> what power! Tossed on pile driver. Here's his window. Will he take advantage? The cover. And that'll do it. It's finally over with the win. Somehow, some way, Yokozuna was stopped and lost this match. You know Yokozuna had a game plan going into this match, and this couldn't have been the ending he had planned for.